Hello everybody and welcome back to Might and Magic Duel of Champions. Here we are. The last and final battle of the May. Well, actually it'll probably be up in June. Because it's uh it's 31st May today. Ranked duel. Open of course. Uh Haven deck, Haven deck and play. Got to win this. Got to win this to level up. Actually I, I bet that if I don't if I don't win this one if I don't win this one I'll try to record one more probably deleting this one. But the problem is that I may not be able to record more sorry more videos today. So if this one will be failed, then I'll probably have to grind on my own to get the to get the freaking rank. So I wish I wish it will be quick and easy win so I can get the rank up. Come on. What is wrong with you? Why do I have to wait so long? 55 seconds for a duel. This is insane. Uh. Okay, this is... No. Better. Who starts? I start. No, he starts. <clears throat> Mother Namtaru, Invoker of Death. Okay, Mother Namtaru. A watchtower! Oh, wonderful! This up here. Um, so I'm gonna start with uh, Imperial Sentinel over here. And think, 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 think. And think, think, think. I need... <coughs> I need more might. That's it. I actually lack spells. I may need more spells. Choose one, draw a card, or if there are fewer friendly creatures than enemy creatures on the battleground, gain plus four. Melee guard two. <clears throat> Oh, well, but as soon as he'll get crippled, he'll be useless. Hmm. I could really use one more resource this this turn. Really, really. Just one more? So then I'd be able to deploy both the Holy Praetorian and the Loyal Griffin. <coughs> and this way I'd be able to perform a successful attack. But oh well. He'll get crippled, he'll get downed to nothing. Lingering Ghost, Incorporeal. Fucking bitch. Fucking bitch. Discard the card, destroy target enemy creature with cost of two or less. And it's free! Ha! Huh. I mean, it's a cost of discard the card, but... Still. Discarding a card ain't that much of a problem. Is it? Oh, crap. And I got a fucking feeling that this one will be lost. Shit. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. There is practically nothing I can do with this dude. Boom! For nothing, and he retaliates for nothing. And son of a bitch! Of course, I had to get some stupid fancy tactics, dude. That is messing up my life. 
use less mystery of Halexia. Haven't I threw this card away? I thought I did. Plague zombie! I'm so fucked up. Come on. Spells! Where are my spells? Give me my spells. I need my spells. Ah, Crusader. Crusader Vanguard. While Crusader Vanguard has no damage, it gains plus one and plus one. Use less. Ah. He'll attack, she'll retaliate for one. Get crippled by one. Hopefully she'll be able to kill him. My god, my cards. They suck. If there are fewer friendly creatures than enemy creatures on the battleground, gain four resource. For the cost of two, if I'd gain four, it will give me a total of seven will be enough to deploy both the Vanguard Lady and the Griffin. And I'll have one more to add no fucking draw a card, whatever. This may actually be a sort of a way to go, but sort of not. Let's try it. Let's let's gain four. Let's drop the Vanguard Lady here, and let's drop the Wild Griffin up there. And I'm so fucking doomed. I don't know. I, I'll increase my magic just in case I'll have a a little bit of fortune. And not get another fortune next turn. Why would anyone ever need so much fucking fortunes? And one building. I mean, come on, out of all the games, I could have lost. It must be that one. The one that I so desperately need to win. Uh, why he did not get hurt for one? Uh, what is the thing? Take a card at random from your graveyard among all the necropolis creatures with a cost of resources two or less that can be deployed at boneyard and deployed as boneyard for at the boneyard. Blah. I can't even talk at the boneyard for free. Why I don't have motherfucking useful cards? Come on, stupid game. Why are you? Why are you doing it to me? Play this card. Celebrations. Better. Fucking gold pile. Come on. You're fucking kidding me. Now oh, finally something useful. Now I don't have enough magic nor resource to use it. Oh, sweet Jesus. Why? Why does it always fucking happen to me? <sighs> Damn, should have used it. Oh, I didn't have enough. If I'd use it now... Huh. Let's, uh... Some sort of way to go. If they attack me for two, I'll preemptively strike. Let's try it. Let's try it this way. It's like it's like the only reasonable thing I can do. Ice wall, wonderful. Fucking son of a bitch. <sighs> Why? Why the fuck does it always have to happen to me? Stupid game.
Yeah, because another stone of enlightenment is perfectly what I need. Hmm, this is so stupid. Oh god. We need four, need four. Oh, fucking blazing glory, wonderful, but I don't have enough might. Oh my god! Why? Why does it have to suck so badly? And I cannot play any motherfucking card. Because fuck you, that's why. <sighs> and I'm fucking full of fortunes! Why would I tell need so many fucking fortunes? <sighs> oh fuck you, heaven! This sucks. This sucks so badly. Unbelievable. And I'll have to grind more on my own, and my rank is totally fucked up, and I'm pissed off, and I. Oh, shh. This is hopeless. This is so motherfucking hopeless. Screw this shit. This game is motherfucking fucked up. <sighs> oh. Whoa! Wow. Why well, I? Uh, you now belong to the rank of squire. Continue. Wow. I'm. I'm. I don't know what to say. Well, actually, that that was the goal. And, uh, well, the, the goal has been achieved, was achieved, uh, mind blown so much, English so difficult to talk with, mind blown, oh my god, what, why the f uh, wait, wait, I, I'm so confused, oh my god, I don't know what happened, I have no fucking idea what happened, I, I, I was, I was raging, I, I rage quit it. And I ranked up! Holy shit, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm so confused, oh my god. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Hey! <laughs> I've unlocked tournaments! Wonderful! Jackpot, Swiss... Or custom, create or join. Okay... I'll have to dig a little bit more into this. Oh, and by the way, um, this is probably this is probably gone. Th this this will be probably gone by the time of uh, of this video being uploaded. But if you haven't noticed yet, the Duel of Champions uh, Facebook page hit uh, 70k likes and to celebrate that they were giving away a code that grants everyone uh, to Heart of Nightmares packs I'm not sure whether these are 
the standard ones. I think these these are the the better ones, the special ones, whatever are they called. They sort of what used to be premium before the game was fucked up. Um, and it was. Yeah, so so by the time the video will be up, I cannot guarantee that this code will work. I'll put it somewhere around, I don't know, somewhere there and probably one more in description for copy-pasting. Though someone Someone posted this under uh, under one of my videos. I think it was Heart of Nightmare Super Packs, but I'm not sure. Mm. Someone posted it. Sorry, man, I don't remember your name. But I did notice it, that you've posted it. Anyway, so yeah, let's, let's open those packs. Congratulations, you just received two wild cards. So yeah, th these are the super packs. Warbound Cyclops, we've seen this one before. Sacrificial Pit. Building whenever an inferno creature at sacri whenever an inferno creature at sacrificial pit dies, deal one damage to every hero. Damn, to enemy hero, sorry. Blessing of the Storm, Enchant Creature, Permanent Enchanted Creature gains Swift and Charge. That's nice. Shark Protector for Sanctuary, Preemptive Strike. Nothing interesting. Lots of health though. Mm. Chronicler. Whenever a Chronicler or a Friendly Beastman creature dies, draw a card. Interesting. Praetorian Captain, hello. Circle of Nine, we've seen this one before. Nautilus. That's a one fancy looking card. Cannot attack. The first time damage is dealt to Nautilus in a turn, prevent that damage. So another tankish creature. Mutual Agony. Enchant creature permanent. When enchanted creature dies, deal two damage to its controller's hero. Ah, cool. You can use it to harass your enemy by killing their creature. S steel of House Anima. Stell, steel, stell. I don't know how to pronounce this thing. Building. Whenever an academy creature or at stell, steel, House of Anima dies, return all spell cards, enchanting it to their owner hand. Delve into madness. Draw two cards and discard the card. Huh. Putrid Dragon, oh my god. Oh my god. This is amazing. Infect 2, Infect Blast 2. Putrid Dragon gets plus 1 attack for each poison counter on enemy creatures. Oh my god, and it's Infect Blasting for 2, so you can... How much is it? It will be 5 creatures, right? No, uh, 4 creatures, because... Uh, the creature you hit and the three adjacent creatures at best will be eight infect counters, um, poison counters, sorry, on them. Which, yeah, w one attack like this will get him up to 11 damage. Overpowered. Hard to land though, probably. But if you if you ra if you land such a critical hit thing. That would be OP. And it's shiny, 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 shiny card. I like shiny cards. You received two wild cards. And luckily I cannot buy the shiny cards for gold anymore. Delve into madness. We've seen this one. Barricade. Building. Neutral building. Interesting. Creatures at barricade gain plus one retaliation for each building adjacent to it. Okay. Storm Rage Warrior. Orc Warrior. Enrage 1. When Storm Rage Warrior enters the battleground, put one Enrage counter on it 
for each friendly warrior creature on the battleground. Agonizing Purge. We've seen this one. Destroy all ongoing spells on target enemy creature. Deal one damage to that creature for each spell. Oh yeah, we've seen this one. Now I remember. Newborn Vampire. He looks kinda ugly. <laughs> no offense, but honestly, yeah. Immune to Retaliation. Life Drain 1. Quite weak, but interesting. Well, actually, Heart of Nightmares brings quite a lot of vampires to the game. Ancestral Champion. Chronicler. Dervish Tent. Dervish, derv, dervish, dervish tent, whatever. Whenever a creature moves to a dervish tent, it gains swift until end of turn. Interesting. Lava spawn. Wow, that's a. Uh... Okay. Well, it's kind of weird and gross thing, in my opinion. You know, like it's like a sort of uh, piece of shit with two damaged wings that is spitting lava from its hole. When lava spawn enters the battleground you cannot use your hero ability until until your next turn. <laughs> lava spawn can only be played if you haven't used your hero ability this turn. That sucks kinda. Falcon Marksman. Immune to Ooh, shiny Falcon Marksman, yes. We know Falcon Marksmen, of course we do know them. I, I have one of these in my in my Haven deck. And this one's shiny. And a shiny Praetorian Captain. Guys, you're definitely going into my deck. And Week of the Elder Races. For 4 resources, all creatures that share a creature type with target creature gain plus 1 and plus 1 until end of turn. Now I'm confused. All creatures that share a creature type with target creature. So I guess you pick this thing, pay four resources, you select a creature, and every creature that shares a creature type. Which one is a creature type? Human? Knight? Both? Sorry. Shooter? Melee? What's the, what's the creature type? What? So difficult. Okay. Nice. That was that was actually nice. That was that was really nice. A and I'm Squire. Good. I d I don't know what to say. It's like I'm I'm still shocked about what happened, because I expected that if I'd surrender, it will count as a lost game and. As such, it will reduce my... oh wait. But if it's like... Oh, it's because they are not showing this uh, MMR points thing. It's just that you know the rank and the percentage. You know, it's like I could have been at like, I don't know... Um, recruit 100% but uh, given the points value of the thing it could have equal to like squire 25 and when i lost the battle while being at let's call it like a uh, recruit 125 i was down to recruit 110 percent and it left me with squire 10 percent i think that's that's how it works i'm not sure but I think that's it. Heart of Nightmare Super Pack. And now it's broken and I cannot close it. Yep. Pretty fancy. Pretty fancy. Yeah, I, I, I'm... Actually, the, the thing that makes me... Well, let's say sad the most. Is actually that I cannot buy the super packs for gold because before with the with all the uh, packs before it was possible to buy them with gold the both the standard version of a pack and the premium version of a pack though i think that the boxes used to gave only the regular packs i want to see how it is now since they've removed the 
10 Forgotten Wars packs. Regular ones. Huh. So that sucks. Base set one box. Uh, yep. This is only the base set one cards. The whatever it was called. The thing that was containing all the uh, the packs from all the expansions was a really cool thing. But it's gone now. Unluckily. Five Towers pack. Five Towers box. Oh well. Unluckily. It's all past now. It was really cool, the, the, the whole thing. While it was working in the uh, previous system. It was really nice. And also, I don't really like the new system. But what can we do? Okay, so I guess that the grind begins. Yep, I'll, I'll start grinding a little bit more on my own, hopefully. I know my god. I'm still shocked about what happened. <sighs> okay, so that will be it for today. I'm gonna drop the code for the packs in the description if you will be able to use it then it's good for you if you won't be able to use it then well not much I can do about it and once again thanks to the dude who posted this in a comment under the video I'm really sorry I don't remember your name uh, man but you've been noticed at least you've been noticed Anyway, uh, thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this video full of rage, which led to rank up. This is, this is really, this is really strange. I, I, I'm really confused by what happened. I expected to, to end up on, uh, back on, uh, what was it, recruit. 80 or, or something like this but no but I got square 10 I'm pretty sure that on the on the uh, on the website it said that I have to win the duel that when when I'm when I'm at 100% I have to win the duel to rank up anyway anyway thanks for watching guys I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next week god knows what will happen in the meantime i'll hopefully grind a little bit hopefully we'll get to something really interesting or maybe we'll even hit a tournament this will be difficult obviously once again thanks for watching guys remember to follow me on twitter if you have any suggestions opinions some sort of rating or whatever just post it in the comments down below the video and have a good time. Bye.